So Tiffany Haddish and Common broke up recently out of the nowhere and broke the heart of fans everywhere. And now Tiffany is speaking out about the real reason that she had to let go of Common. So Tiffany Haddish and Common started dating in 2020 and in August of that same year, they went public with the relationship. And honestly, they were super cute together. But then things kind of fizzled out in late 2021 and they announced that they had broken up. But how did they go from being one of the cutest couples in Hollywood to breaking up after just one year of dating. Now, some of y'all know that Common dated Angela Rye in 2017. They broke up and for a while, we didn't really know what caused the breakup. But I didn't think that that many people thought too deeply about it because hey, this is Hollywood and people break up like every five minutes. What we do know is that Common felt largely responsible for the breakup because he went to therapy after the breakup. He felt like he was going around in circles when it comes to his love life because he had had a couple of failed relationships from Erica Badu to Taraji P. Henson and even Serena Williams. Yeah, that man has had his fair share of celebrity relationships. After his therapy, he felt like he was finally ready to be in a healthy relationship that would eventually lead to marriage to the right woman. He said this in an interview on Good Morning America. You want to be a husband one day. You have a, a rather famous relationship coach. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah that, yes, uh, Michelle Obama, she has definitely helped talk me through just certain moments of relationships. We had conversations and she has given me a lot of wisdom. But one great thing that, that she told me as I was going through this journey was that you have to understand you're not going to get anybody that's perfect because you're not perfect. So understand that there's some certain things that you will compromise in, in, in choosing that partner but long as long as the the core values the values that are most important to you that person you know marks off on that list then you good she gave you some good advice there that's good wisdom. then in 2019 he and tiffany worked on the movie the kitchen and this is where they first struck up a friendship at this time common was still into tiffany big time even though she wanted to just remain friends she had common solidly in the friend zone and then common kind of gave up on her for a little bit because he soon announced that he was getting back together with his ex angela rye he revealed that he was a much better partner to angela the second time around and he credited therapy with helping him to achieve this. He also claimed that he saw himself being with Angela long term and kind of hinted that he might even get married to her eventually. But then this never happened because this second relationship with Angela only lasted for a couple of weeks and then they soon broke up. The reason behind their second breakup is pretty interesting though and to some extent it played a role in Common's breakup with Tiffany too. You see Angela started getting baby fever and she talked to Common about how she maybe wanted her own kids somewhere down the line. Common was not on board with this and he said he wasn't so sure about it. Obviously, this was a deal breaker for Angie and she soon broke things off with him. But the whole time, Tiffany was still in the picture. But as I said earlier, she was just friends with him. Around the time that he had broke things off with Angela, Tiffany decided to give him a shot. This was in the early days of 2020. They were much more than friends, but they weren't exactly together together, if you know what I mean. Y'all know that weird place between being in a relationship and being friends, kind of a situationship. Yeah, that's where they were. They finally decided to dive right in and make things official and fans were overjoyed. I know y'all remember that time Tiffany was on Instagram live with Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade and she moved the camera to show common in the background. That was the first time they went social media official and it was so cute. After the IG live, they started gushing over each other every chance they could get and fans were loving it. They talked about their relationship and their romance at every opportunity they got, and it was obvious that they were super into each other. They even admitted that they had never been happier in a relationship. Then in November 2021, things started to fall apart for them. It all started when Common had Tiffany as a guest on his podcast, and the topic somehow turned into the issue of kids and whether or not Tiffany wanted kids. Tiffany admitted that she did want kids and she wanted to either foster or adopt kids in the future. Yeah, this was when fans say yikes as you guys remember the reason that common broke up with angela rye the second time around is because she wanted kids and he was sure that he didn't and when one person
person in a relationship wants kids and the other person doesn't, well, it often leads to friction. And unfortunately, in Tiffany and Common's case, it was one of the factors that eventually broke their relationship. This ultimately caused some cracks in the relationship and fans were quick to notice this. For example, for her 41st birthday, she told Extra TV that she was hoping for something really special from her man Common. She said, I'm just hoping me and my men, we go on hot air ballooning and having us a nice meal. That's what I like to do. Every birthday, I try to do something I've never done before. I feel like it's an exciting way to live life. On my 39th birthday, I got drunk with my grandma. Never done that before. And my 40th birthday, I had a bat mitzvah and that was super fun. This birthday, 41, I wanna go up in a hot air balloon. But on her birthday, all she posted were videos of flowers that he had sent her. There was no comment as to whether or not he had gotten her that hot air balloon ride that she wanted or a nice dinner. Yeah, I know that there's a chance that he did get it for her and she just decided to keep it low key. But come on guys, we all know that this isn't the case here, especially with Tiff, cause she is so outspoken and fun. This just hinted that things had cooled down a lot between them. And not long after this, Tiffany spoke to People Magazine about her relationship and well, she got pretty honest about things between them. She said, he's still not the entire package, but he's a majority of the change that I need. I don't think anybody's a whole package. I might be a pessimist in this way, but I don't think there's any person that's a whole shebang. Everything you want. I think that's impossible. I know that she was just being honest, but I know that must have stung Common real bad. She also revealed that their work schedules made it really hard for them to be together as much as they would like. But that is what made their time even more special. But their time together would soon be cut short because May 2021, Tiffany made up in her mind about having kids and she even started taking parenting classes. Now in September 2021, they were still together and Tiffany even revealed that she wanted Common to propose to her with some real estate instead of an engagement ring. And Common has something to say about that. I'm gonna do what's good for, for me and the lady, <laughs> you know. Right now, all I want is happiness, good times, um, peace on earth. <laughs> Also, when he was asked about the relationship and whether we could expect a wedding announcement, he claimed that they were taking things day by day. Yeah, this was when I started suspecting that things were about to come to an end for them. I was right because they broke up only a couple weeks later. Speaking to People Magazine, a source revealed that their super busy schedules kept them too busy for a serious relationship. Comment also confirmed this in an interview with Hollywood Unlocked. I think once Tiffany and I got back on the move, it, it really didn't allow for us to spend as much time and put as much energy into our relationship. I don't think the love really dispersed. I just think it was just like, we weren't feeding the relationship. But not long after this interview, Tiffany shared her side of the story and she revealed that they had not been together intimately for a couple of weeks before the breakup. She said, he might be the type of person that never really settles with somebody. Maybe he's like, you know, like a bee going from flower to flower to flower. I don't know, I wish him nothing but joy and happiness, you know, he will always be cool. But this ain't making sense because that man keeps saying that he wants to settle down but keeps going woman to woman. This kind of makes me feel like Tiffany he felt maybe used by Common. As she hinted, he has been with a lot of famous women and it kind of feels like a game to him, if you know what I mean. Reacting to the breakup, a fan said, Common don't stay with no one. If Erica Badu couldn't keep him, no woman can. Another fan said, he's just going through successful black women. Stop dating him. And someone else said, did people really think that would last? Common hasn't kept a city relationship ever. So yeah, Tiffany left Common because they both wanted different things. I get the feeling that she was pretty hurt by the breakup, but you gotta respect her for handling like a queen and not making the breakup messy. Speaking of messy, if you want some really messy drama, then you better check out this video.